what I have here is the base for my paper roller coaster. I will begin by building the framework, which is outlined here. I will use these materials scissors, pen, and this cardstock to begin building my roller coaster. After successfully following building framework, this is what a column should look like inside with tape along the outside. And I'll have to do this most of the time with this right here. Use a ruler to bring this along the dotted lines, trace, fold four times, and this is the end product. 45 minutes into construction, and I have about 8 beams, 8 columns, and my 3 stacks of card for tomorrow. I'm putting that on my little cardboard box over there. Three hours in the second day. I have all flat tracks, came with set complete, cut out multiple sharp curves, have completed all columns, beams, and support beams, and I even have a merger for a little surprise later on. I now have completed cutting out wide curves, which finished product looks like this, one loop, which finished product looks like this, sharp curve, like this, I still have a few more loops to cut out, and I'm waiting to attach all the columns, beams, and support beams to my poster board, which I'll be doing tomorrow morning. Day three, I've begun, well, actually completed placing all columns, which are these right here. Begin placing beams, support it. My next task is I'm placing tracks from beam to beam, and that I will have to do tomorrow. An hour into construction on day three, seen here, gives me about a 10 second loop to actually prove it works. I'll do a little test run. All I have so far. Alright, end of day four. Completed almost three quarters. And we actually have two different tracks going on. I'm going to have a demonstration on our brother here. He's going to drop it down number one. Alright, go ahead. And number two. We only have two marbles. They both go to the funnel. And there we go. And we'll add on to this tomorrow. Alright guys, day six is coming to a stop. I have two separate tracks. That's the last video shown. The first track should end up between that yellow piece of paper and the white piece of paper. However, I've come to a hold because I begin building the second track. And this is the end of it right here. And I should be able to complete from here, loop around to the same piece of paper. So it ends in the same place, but it starts in two different places. I'm going to show you how it works to go to two different pieces using this little piece right here. It's called a switch. A marble will go down and flick it this way, and then the marble will go down this way and change it again. Alright, I'm going to show you first by dropping it down the big end. As you can see, that ended up in the end. Now I'll go on the short end. However, that didn't work as planned, so let's try that again, placing the switch facing the other way so the marble will roll down this path. I'm going from the short one. There's that now, as you can see, that the path is switched. We'll try again by starting off the marble. 
Now it should go down this line there. That is how it's supposed to work. Next video. Alright everyone. It's a finished project. It's May 7th, 2013. Well, this ends up being about four foot tall. Two different tracks. Two loops two funnels, and a bunch of other things, and it all comes to an end right there. Actually, if you see right here, it actually connects into one. Okay, let's see how this works. And it ends up right there. Alright, now let's have one going down this way, and one going down this way. There it is. That's real. Right, now that we've seen that both tracks are completely functional. They both are right there between the yellow and the white. Let's see what I can do with five marbles at one time. Keep an eye out through the video of this switch right here as it works back and forth between this way and that way. Which again lines up that little tunnel there and you can't see it. Alright. Let's give it a go. I know that was hard to follow. There's product, five marbles, right where I put them. Thanks a lot, guys.